This is not what you want to see in your fish, a live worm wiggling around. A viewer sent us this video after seeing our story last night on 10 News at 11. 10 News reporter Joe Little was surprised to learn that these worms are no big deal if you do just one thing. Heads up, you can close your eyes and listen if you don't want to watch the video. It's another episode of As the Stomach Turns. There's a worm. Yep. There's the worm, wrapped with some salmon inside a San Marcos Costco. It clearly took Sarah Porsche by surprise. That was super gross. Super gross for sure, but apparently not super rare. I just can't get rid of it on my mind. This woman says she also found a worm in the salmon she bought at a Costco in Chula Vista. Costco gave her money back. We saw it last night and then I had the video. I'm like, oh my goodness. Sarah says she pointed the worm out to a Costco employee who wasn't surprised. It was really nonchalant, just like, yeah, no big deal. And I was like, ah. So far, three 10 News viewers said they found worms like this guy hanging out in some cod. But a simple search of worms and salmon reveals a long list of cases of these little buggers creeping in your dinner. Most of these websites said it's normal, even okay, as long as you freeze or thoroughly cook the salmon. Eating it raw could ruin your night and the next few days. Sarah says the Costco employee told her the same thing. You know, if you cook it really well, that's why it's important to cook it really well. I'm like, ew. Costco didn't have a comment after we contacted their corporate headquarters for both salmon stories. Sarah still has some in her freezer. But this is the safe kind. She says she still loves Costco and will continue to shop there, but she'd like something added to the fish. A label of some kind to watch out for this, make sure you cook it well. It's the only way to make sure this guy doesn't end up inside you as well. So salmon's taking a break. Yes. Joe Little. For a long time. 10 News. <laughs> It's a good point. Be nice to have a label on there just telling you what to do. Yeah, and I, I think, you know, everyone has Costco, uh, you mm -hmm. know, feelings, and most people go to Costco and they have a lot of good things. Okay, that, I think they need to look at where they're sourcing their salmon. True, that's a good point. You know, that might be a solution. 10 News reached out to the California Department of Public Health to make sure there isn't an increase in these worms. They told us they are working on collecting all of this information. All right.